Are you looking to create interesting videos on your mobile phone? Hey, what up, Defensive Marketers? Today we're going to be talking about this app here. It's called Voice Over Air. And it's available on iOS and Android. And what this app does for you, it helps you to create text to voice messages on your phone. And it also has a music library attached to it. Um, I believe it's uh, royalty free as well so you can add that into your videos and it also features a simple basic uh, basic video editor where you can trim the video trim the audio uh, or you know move your you know your clips around here and there right so it's a very simple tool and you know you have you know some voice con uh, volume control, speed control, uh, pitch control as well so you can create some interesting videos in there right so before I dive into voice over air be sure to hit that subscribe button if you like to see more digital marketing and e-commerce content right so here we go so here we are in uh, voice over app so this is uh, you know this is a screencast of my mobile phone okay so i'm using android here obviously uh this uh this is actually using a power mirror right so i've actually uh reboot this uh app itself in my uh channel right so if you're looking for something that you can screencast your phone to the pc or the other way around right you can check out a power mirror it's a very very powerful uh you know application here right so uh what you need to do this is how uh, voice over air looks like right so it's powered by epidemic sound okay so i'm not really sure what that is uh so you can also i guess uh, change the app uh language in there uh, then uh, you know you can sign up for some of their subscription uh that they have okay but they do uh, if you're looking at it right now they do have a lifetime deal right here you see that uh, lifetime deal okay uh, so you can just pay once and use this for life okay? you can use this for life all right okay and of course if you need help you can contact them from here by email uh, and then there's a short video that shows you how to use it but you know, we're going to skip that because i'm going to show you how to do it Anyway, and then uh, you can check out the profile and you can see you know uh, like how much you have uh, in your plan of course they do have a free plan as well so if you want to test that out and if you need more later uh, you can do it you can use that as well Oops. okay you know what let me just kind of close this for a bit and open up the app again. Okay, there we go. Uh, because when I open up, you know, the how it works, it started to play the video in the background. Okay, so here we are. Just uh, just tap on get started. Okay, and then you get into uh, this uh, sort of like a video editor mode. So uh, you can change the language in here. So they have a ton of language in there. Uh, you can see, you know. Uh, in Tamil, uh, blah, 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 right? Arabic, Bangla, uh, Bulgarian, Chinese, Catalan. Uh, I think this is probably like Cantonese, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, Croatian, uh, Danish, uh, Dutch, English, of course. Uh, a lot of options in here, right? French and all that. Okay, so uh, because I'm just gonna keep it as English, then if I want to, maybe I'll just choose English Singapore. I can choose between uh, Juan or Richard, okay, which is a little weird because we don't have like Singaporean names like that, okay. So I'm gonna choose uh, here uh, to keep uh, girls. Dancing in, uh, uh, in dancing without a care in the world. Appears uh, children. I've seen. 
Okay, so let's let's just use something like that. Uh, you know, because I have a video um, that I've downloaded from Pexels. Okay, and we're gonna use that. Right? So we can we can hear how the voice sounds like, but of course uh, you are not gonna be able to hear it. So uh, so I'll just try to put it close to my microphone so that uh, it plays back. Here are two cute girls dancing without the care in the world. Happiest children I've seen. Okay. Um, I guess it's somewhat like uh, a Singaporean voice, but it is weird. Okay, I mean, sounded weird. The, the, the Singaporean accent sounded weird. Here are two cute girls dancing without a care in the world. Happiest children I've seen. Okay, I mean, uh, I, I kind of find that a little awkward as well. Um, I mean, some Singaporeans do speak like that, but it seems a little too heavy because, you know, we are, you know, a city, uh, we don't actually speak to such thick uh, and weird accent, I would say. <laughs> okay, uh, it kind of sounded a little bit like a Malaysian speaking as well. Okay, so we're going to try a different voice, uh, something that I would prefer. Uh, that sounded a little bit more natural for me. Here are two cute girls dancing without a care in the world. Happiest children I've seen. Okay, so I guess we'll go with that. Alright, so you can change the volume right here as you can see. And also, um, you know, the speed of the voice. Right, So you can slow it down, you can move it faster. Uh, but I would say that if you slow it too much, it Sign, it kind of sounds like the person is very uh, disinterested, right? So you know, I, I'm just gonna show you how it sounded like. Here are two cute girls dancing without a care in the world. Happiest children I've seen. Right, as you can see, right? So I mean, you can hear that. It sounded very lazy, you know, and disinterested, and bored. Here are two cute girls dancing without a care in the world. Happiest children I've seen. And, I mean, moving it faster is fine. Uh, you know, you can change the volume, and of course you can change the pitch. Let's try that. Here are two cute girls dancing without a care in the world. Happiest children I've seen. Alright, so it becomes chipmunks, of course, when you move it up. Okay, so I guess pitch, right, also affects the uh, the speed of the voice as well because uh, you know when you increase the playback speed, uh, it increases the pitch, which is you know how like normal audio works. So I guess if I were to slow down the, I would lower the pitch. I may have increased the speed just to you know kind of. Balance it down. Okay, so uh, you know, I mean, you guys can play around with it. Uh, I'm just gonna keep it back to where it was so that you know it's not overly weird. Okay, so we we'll keep it there, and then the next step is then to add your music. Uh, it looks like I can. Create multiple clips here. Let me just try that. Okay, maybe I can have multiple voices uh, in the app itself, so I've not tested it to to that level, right? So I'm just gonna. Right, so I can add multiple voices in here. You can see, right, there's two tracks in there now. Okay, uh, I'm just gonna add it. And, uh, okay, so editing is incredibly simple as well. I'm gonna move it a little bit over here. Okay, so and then just click on save. Okay, so you just uh, tap on edit, right, and then oops.
okay, uh, I can only move it to here, but of course once I import the music or the audio, then it will uh, be fine, okay. Um, so I'm just going to put in the music right here, okay. Right, I've not tried like how many voices you can add, uh, but you know, if you want to try adding more voices, you can. And then you can choose all the music in here. There's a lot of uh, choices. So let's say I want something happy, right? So we have happy, we have euphoric, so we can choose any of the two. Uh, let's choose this. Okay, so it does take a while to. Okay, I like this. I'm just gonna import this. Alright, so I think. Uh, okay, so the music is in now. Okay, so the next thing is uh, we have the video. Right? So I'm just gonna import the video first, and then we'll do some simple editing, and then we can get our video out. Right? Okay, so I'm gonna use this. Okay, so there we go. Right, so we have the video, uh, which is 14 seconds long. Uh, okay, so now uh, if I want to edit, right? So editing is very simple. Just tap on edit right here, then it will sort of full with the tracks over here. Now you want to select the uh, what do you call it? The uh, the track that you want to edit. So I'm gonna edit the uh, audio track. So I'm just gonna move it. Right. Okay, so so if you tap, see what happens is you, you tap at the three bars like a vertical uh, hamburger bar, uh, you know, icon. Just tap on it, and then you will expand out. Right. So we're gonna of course shrink it down to the video length. Okay, and then save it. Next, we will edit the voice up here. Okay. So we can move it maybe somewhere right here. Okay, so maybe I'll move it here and then this I'll move it a little later. So there we go. Uh, and then the audio right here. Let me just expand it. Okay, I guess uh, I'm going to have shrink it too much. So it's already safe, but we will stick to this and then we can play. Let's see what happens. Here are two cute girls dancing without a care in the world. Happiest children I've seen. Watching this makes me feel happy. Okay, so it's uh, you know, some stock photo, stock view I got from uh, Hexos. So you know that so there are two voices in there, so that is great, right? So you can have multiple voices, uh, in here, uh, but of course you can only have one video, and I think only one, uh, music in there as well. Okay, so pretty much that's all how uh you know voiceover air app works. I think this is great, you know, especially if you are, you know, creating a lot of video content from your phone. Uh, you know, I think this 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 helps you to save a lot of time. You know, I think this is probably good for maybe your reels or you know, your TikTok videos, whatever it is, right? Uh, I guess you know that's all I have to share about voice over air. Uh, overall, I think that this app itself has the users. Uh, but unfortunately, I'm just here to kind of show you how it works. I am not really a mobile phone you know uh, like a uh, mobile person uh, I'm not very into TikTok or whatever it is I'm not a very I would say like video or photo kind of person on social media right I don't use much Instagram I don't use much TikTok um, so I don't think I would get a lot of use out of it but I think that you know um, if you are the kind of person, I think this app would, you know, you would be already be looking at this app because you would need something like that for your videos, right? So I guess that's all I have to share about voice over app. If you enjoyed this 
video do give me a thumbs up let me know what you think about voice over app in the comments below lastly if you know anyone who benefit from it be sure to share this video with them i'll see you in my next video bye bye